Hello, my name is Mike Patkey. I'm here to give a testimony to my journey with Christ. Um, about seven years ago, I moved to Anza, not knowing anybody, pretty much basically homeless. I didn't know anybody, nobody knew me. My brother brought me up here to check out this really cool church called Living Hope. So I, I got involved in the church and, and started meeting people and starting serving the Lord and, and just becoming active in church. And then it was um, maybe a few years later that I started Chair Boundless Self-Defense, which um, it's not really so much self-defense, but it's teaching people how to rely on God and how to learn to walk in the Spirit. Well, that was really um, successful. And God said He wanted to move me back to Ridgecrest. And I, I was thinking, not Ridgecrest. I don't want to go back to Ridgecrest. So, but I, I was being obedient, went to Ridgecrest, and uh, continuing to expand Chair Boundless. And it was really taking off and growing. And um, I also got to get back in contact with homeless people in Ridgecrest and inspiring them to uh, rise above their circumstances. And that homeless being homeless is not um it's not a sentence it's a it's a, uh, a condition it's a circumstance you know we can we can all find ourselves that way in fact we're all pretty much homeless living here on earth our, our home is in heaven and if we continue to serve god um we find that we are blessed beyond beyond belief um, I would get up in the morning and I would pray for God to pour his blessings through me onto others. And I was um, in a position to where people would donate hospital beds and wheelchairs and rockers to me. And then I would donate them to other people that are in need. And each person that came to pick up a wheelchair or a hospital bed, I would I would let them know that you know, you're an answer to my prayers. I ask God to pour his blessings through me to others. So whether they're coming to in need of one or if they wanted to donate one, I would be able to share God's um, glory right there, saying that they're an answer to my prayers. I knew God had some work for me to do there and in Ridgecrest, and that was to shine his light, inspire the others that were still homeless to rise above that. And I knew that um, through obedience that once the work was done in Ridgecrest that he was going to let me move back to Anza. And here I am back in Anza continuing chair boundless and, and we're, we're still we're doing uh, the hospital equipment here as well. If you need a hospital bed or a wheelchair or a walker or if you want to donate one, this is where we go. We just we ask God, you know, and if, if we're in need, you know, he, he says, you have not because you ask not. Just ask. Be specific and be detailed in what it is you want. Ask God for it and just put your eyes on him. That's where the truth is at, is in Jesus. Amen.